good morning beautiful people today is june 26th it is early <laughs> i am getting ready to work i am exhausted i didn't get oh no they didn't lock me out i didn't get any real sleep last night oh that means everything i typed in there didn't save that makes me angry yep lovely all right sorry anyways <laughs> it's early i have y'all this is disgusting this is disgusting i bought vegan protein shakes i don't like this i'm gonna go <clears throat> i'm gonna make my own and then just put them in bottles y'all my arm is killing me today like i am hurt and i didn't really get any sleep and then on top of that my asthma started acting up so i have my um god what is this uh paw sock paw socks uh out I was, I'm tired. Like I said, I, don't, I, I think I already said that. I was struggling last night, trying to p get my arm in a good position, and I should have called out today. I thought about it, cause my arm is. Oh, I didn't check my email. I opened up my email. I'm like, something don't seem right yet today. Check my 100 emails to see how many emails I got. Oh, I only got 33. Woohoo! But, um, like I was saying, my arm is killing me. Excuse me. Killing me. I need to, uh, I do not want to drink this. This thing is so disgusting. And I know I typically don't like protein shakes that are in this. Like, I can do the powder and mix it together myself, but all this extra stuff that they put in there, ugh, it's just so disgusting so disgusting i've been trying to do it in like one big gulp but it wants to touch my tongue y'all let me show y'all again what it look like child i'm gonna pick y'all up later i still need to make the bed the house is becoming a disaster because i couldn't clean this past weekend and like trying to clean stuff with one hand and try to do stuff with just one extremity totally sucks like but I need to let this one heal because, y'all, yeah. I'm going to pick you up later. I'm just talking to talk. All right, so I had to, like, take off of work. I cannot type. The pain, I'm looking for my remote so I can pause this video. The pain in my arm is absolutely ridiculous. Like, I was typing up some stuff earlier and, oh, there we go. I'm sorry, I'm probably making y'all dizzy, but I was typing up some stuff earlier and when I tell you that pain ran all the way up my arm and my shoulder, absolutely awful, absolutely awful. I, I now I got my sling on because, like I said, I mean I got it on wrong. I need to make it tighter because the further it is, further I need it like right here. That's really really feels good. But y'all, I am struggling over here. My. Uh, I need to clean, like, I had the heating pad out. I just put the, um, oh, this ain't been on no more. I just put, I broke a heating pad because I was using it so much. I got two heating pads. This one is broke now. I'm about to order another one. But this one went out, so we got that one. And I'm about to order another back one off of Amazon. Hopefully, it can get here ASAP because, baby, I meant to order it yesterday. But, yeah, I'll be in my own little world. But... It, it just hurt so bad hurt so so bad y'all my head cut off sorry i just this is some bull crap that's all i'm gonna say like i was literally typing on i was like oh, okay maybe it'll go away no i just kept on making it worse oh this is hurting so bad i took ibuprofen computer how much time on my ibuprofen timer about five hours and 17 Bruh. minutes left i don't need like a narcotic i just need something that's gonna relieve this this it's like it's tingly it's numb it's like sharp pains it's like all pains all in one but it isn't enough to make me need like a narcotic a narcotic can't talk but it's just very 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 uncomfortable and again i have a high t uh, pain tolerance from having endometriosis so maybe this would be like crazy for somebody else but for me i'm like yeah it's it hurts it really 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 hurts but it doesn't hurt so much that i need to be in tears 
but it was very uncomfortable when I had got on um, my lap, not my laptop, on my keyboard and I was sitting here and trying to type. I was like, okay. And I was typing for like, I've been typing for maybe, cause I got at work at nine. I was at work for an hour and 24 minutes. So about, that's about how long I was typing. And then my arm was like, oh, okay. You think this is a joke? <laughs> but yeah, so. And I had a, I have a lot of like materials that I need to update and create. And of course I need to use my keyboard. And it, it just wasn't working today, y'all. It just wasn't working today. My arm hurts so bad. I called a orthopedic doctor. Yeah, I called an orthopedic day. They haven't called me back. I have to find something. I was going to go to urgent care, but I'm like, what can urgent care do for me? I don't need no more of that stupid steroid because that obviously ain't working. Make me so mad. I drank that protein shake. Nasty. And I had a smoothie. I'm surprised I'm hungry. Typically, well, yesterday when I drank that, uh, well, I had my protein shake and I had ate a protein bar. I wasn't even thinking. And then I had that at 11 and then I wasn't hungry again until like 4 or 5 o'clock. So, but now I had that protein shake at 9. All right, yeah, 9. And a smoothie. I have both of them because I couldn't take that taste of that protein shake. I have both of those at 9. It's 12.36. And I'm hungry. So I'm about to go eat those tacos that I made the other day. Some vegan tacos. I think I got some left. For sure I do. And that's about it. Alright, this is what I'm having for lunch. It's impossible meat, rice. I made uh, cilantro lime rice the other day. Got tomatoes, taco sauce, and some fresh cilantro on top. I am also having a pineapple jaritos. Oh, that's how you pronounce it. <laughs> Good morning, beautiful people. Today is Wednesday, June 28th. I have had a rough couple of days. My arm hurts so bad. My fingers are numb. I'm getting ready to log into work. I didn't go to work on, well, I left early on Monday. I was there for, I told you, I think I told you guys I was just there for an hour and, let me put y'all down because, whew, child. I was there for like an hour and 24 minutes and then I didn't go to work yesterday and I'm going to work today because I have a class to teach. I don't feel so great, but I'm gonna just go and teach this class and I'm not gonna use this left arm like I've been doing all week. Like, I'll move it, but I use my right arm more. And I feel like I'm going to be buffing this arm because I'm using him, like, double now. This arm, when I do go, like, to move it or, like, pick something up without realizing that I'm doing it, it feels weird because I've been limiting uh, how much I've been using this arm. And it just feels, like, foreign to me. Like, whenever I... It's just weird. I don't know how to explain it, but it just feels weird. But the pain is still, like, right up in here. And the spasms are still here, and it's still going down my uh, arm up into my wrist. It stops at my wrist. My fingers were tingling a little bit. The fingers don't tingle that much, but the other pain is like a constant pain. I have taken uh, ibuprofen. Well, I stopped taking ibuprofen. I take uh, 500 milligrams of naproxen now. And y'all, hooch. That's all I'm going to say is hooch. I got this uh, splint. I don't think, I mean, not splint, this, uh, yeah, this is a splint, um, but I don't think I'm going to use it, because <sighs> all I did was rest my arm yesterday in bed. I bought one crazy, I rested my arm, and I had it on the heating pad, my ice pack bust, so I don't know if I told y'all that the other day or not, <laughs> but my ice pack uh, burst, so I don't have an ice pack anymore. And yeah, that's about it. Now I'm about to make the bed with one more.
hello beautiful people i'm looking for my remote out oh, there i'm watching my girl again uh carla from just vlogging life make sure y'all check her out but anyways i um i don't know what the last time i was on here i forgot to look back but today is friday the 30th it is 6 34 p.m <laughs> i am exhausted i took a um muscle relaxer last night and whenever I take muscle relaxer, like I took a whole muscle relaxer because my arm was just, it just kept on spasming. And I was like, I couldn't, I couldn't sleep. So I had eventually had to take something and it happened the night before. The night before I didn't get any sleep. I was like, I refuse to do this tonight. So I took a whole flex rail. And whenever I take a muscle relaxer, it takes literally 24 hours to leave my system. So I've just been walking around the house blah. I can't remember what time I took it last night. Maybe, well, not like like last night, but I don't, I don't even know what time I took it. I couldn't even tell you. Maybe 8 o'clock. I don't know, but I was like, I refuse to sleep like that. My arm has been doing a lot of spasming today. Well, like now it's doing a lot of spasming, but I was like, I'm not taking another Flexerol because I can't do get nothing done. I just feel so lethargic. I was in the middle of folding clothes and watching my girl uh her vlog but i um i can't function on muscle relaxers let me know if you've ever taken a muscle relaxer and if you feel like the same way like you can't function off of them this arm still hurts i don't see a doctor until thursday i don't see a doctor until thursday no, this is some crap but it still hurts i need to get my hair done i'm getting my hair done next saturday i'm just getting the front redone and then I need my eyebrows done, but the lady that does my eyebrows, I get my eyebrows threaded and I got to hold it like this and like this with this arm and I can't keep this arm like bent up for too long because it doesn't feel good and I just look like Wolverine over here with these bushy eyebrows. But I'm so happy that that Flexero is finally leaving my system because child, I, I've been walking around the house like blah. So blah today. Uh, I just be well. Nobody's here, but JoJo went to work. Nice. I don't know where Nia is. Am Ambrose is out of town visiting family. Y'all. I just. I've been feeling blah all day. I, I literally like. A few minutes before I picked up the camera, I was like, "Oh, it's finally leaving my system, y'all." <laughs> and I'm so happy, so happy it's finally leaving my system because baby. I was struggling. Um, I got Spanish tomorrow. I got a whole list of stuff I need to be doing. I'm supposed to be resting my arm, but I've noticed that when I try to go grasp something, my uh, when I grab something, my grasp is off. It's like it's it's like this arm is so weak now because I have been avoiding using it. So now I need to rebuild, I guess, my muscle memory and child because I was like, ah. Uh -uh. This hand, this hand is freezing. This hand is hot. And y'all, I don't know what's going on with me. Other than I'm getting old. I was going to go to Target when I got off. But like I said, I was so lethargic and so like, not out of it. But I know I shouldn't be operating a vehicle. So I was just like, whatever. I'll just walk around the house like a freaking zombie. Um, but yeah, I got stuff to do tomorrow. So hopefully I remember to take my camera and take you guys with me. Probably go to Target tomorrow. I got my Spanish class tomorrow. I got a list right here. Uh, I can't remember where else I need to go. I didn't write the other stories now. And of course I don't remember them because I was so out of it. I thought about it earlier, but I'm like, where do I need to go now? Yeah, I'm just talking to talk, but I'm about to go back to watching my girl and finish folding up these towels. Like I said... I've been letting my arm rest for like it's been over a week since I've been trying to like avoid using this arm. But today, like when I try to grab stuff, like, ooh, that hurt. When I try to grab stuff, like I know I'm holding it. I know that I'm holding it, but my my grasp is not as tight as it is for this one. I don't know how to explain it, explain it other than my hand isn't grasping this correctly. Like I know it's in my hand, but I feel like I'm gonna drop it because it isn't grasping it like this. You see how strong this is? And then when I try to do it on this one, I guess it really doesn't make any sense to you guys of me trying to show y'all. I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below. <laughs> but it, I, I don't know. How, other than 
I don't know any other way to explain it other than my grasp is off. I didn't know this was sticky. Um, but yeah, I will, I might just go back to floating these clothes or floating these towels and, uh, ooh, I don't know why I keep doing that when I just said it the first time that it hurt. Um, about to fold these towels and yeah, I ain't got nothing to do. Like I said, I'm going to just go to Target tomorrow. I might like try to straighten up the room, try to like get, move my arm again because like I said, the memory, I, muscle memory, I think that's what it's called. Muscle memory is like off in my, my hand isn't grabbing onto stuff the correct way. But anyways, let me finish folding these towels. Good morning, beautiful people. Today is July 1st. I feel a whole lot better today. Like I got that medicine out of my system, but it is computer off. Why is she over here listening to my conversation? I think it's like, it's like 10.30, almost 10.30 in the morning. Um, my Spanish classes are in like 30 minutes. So I'm about to hop in the shower. Uh, I do want to go to the farmer's market today and get some stuff, make me some food. Uh, my arm still feels about the same. I can, I can use it more. I've been like using my Chinese exercise balls. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about. I need to hurry up and get in the shower. Oh, it's 10, 17. But I've been using these to like exercise my hands. So what I do is I just go like this. Oh, Lord Jesus. <laughs> Anyways, I just go like this. So I can get my muscle memory back in my hand. But I just been using those. I've had those for years. Probably like 10 years I've had those. I don't know. But I'm about to, um, like I said, I'm about to get in the shower. I know I keep moving the uh, camera like all crazy, y'all, but I'm sorry. Uh, I'm about to get in the shower. It's going to be like 90, I think she said 93 today. So it's going to be hot. I don't know if I want to put on shorts or if I just want to throw on a dress. I might just throw on the dress because that's going to be so much easier. But I'm in the middle of like talking to y'all and making a bit. But I'm about to jump in the shower right now. I make this bit when I get out. Because I need to wash up. And then, oh yeah, me and Joe need to go grocery shop. He and I'm on there. Man, we're going grocery shopping. We're going grocery shopping. So we're going to go grocery shopping. And oh yeah, that don't feel good in that one or in that hand. Uh, so I'm gonna go grocery shop like a quick grocery shop But yeah, I will pick you guys up later over the big old fans in here but i'm in the other building and there's like nothing in here i can never remember what time they close and i can never make it on time so i am just up in here walking and just looking at like nothing because there's like nothing left but yeah i'm gonna just turn around yeah let me show you guys what's in this one which is basically nothing there's like oh, sorry there's two no two or three buildings first building there's never anything in there. there's the middle building there's always stuff in there now I'm in the third building which actually has nothing in it I always miss this one like I can literally never make this one I always forget about the flower building I really rarely go into the flower building but we're gonna walk over there now. And then they have like a few food trucks over there. I'm gonna go look at the flowers. It 
it's so hot that I am nauseous. Like, I feel like I'm about to throw up. That's how hot it is out here. It says it's 91 degrees outside and it's only 235. I'm about to come another day. I gotta get myself together because I feel like I'm gonna throw up. I can't drive and be feeling nauseous, but I'm about to come another day where like come bright early because like everyone's packing up and leaving even though the sign says like they close at five but i guess people can leave whenever they want to leave but i'm have it says they open at eight so i'm gonna have to come here one saturday at like 8 a.m it also says that they're open on sundays oh excuse me but i don't think a lot of them be here on sundays simply because you know church and whatnot Y'all, you see all this sweat? Ugh, disgusting. I'm about to go home and take another shower, but I really feel nauseous. Like, I need to find something to drink. I need to find some water. Because I feel so sick. I just had the uh, AC on, but I had to turn it off so you guys can actually hear me. But let me show you guys what I picked up. I just threw it in the back. So, I picked up a zucchini. Also, I'm gonna do myself like a little meal prep for myself. I also picked a uh, um, uh, green onions. What do you call these? Do you guys call them green onions or do you call them uh, scallions? And then I picked up some mushrooms. If you don't know, I am a fiend for some mushrooms. Brown mushrooms. I don't like no white mushrooms. Yes, I discriminate. <laughs> Then I got a green tomato. I'm making me some fried green tomatoes because Carla keeps showing her little fried green tomatoes in her video, y'all. So I'm like, let me go and make me some vegan fried green tomatoes. And I want to make me some lemonade. So I picked up three lemons. Oh, Lord Jesus. Oh, that smells so good. Oh, that smells so good. Okay. Yeah, I'm crazy. And then I picked up a mango. Hopefully it don't taste nasty. It is a little soft. Like, you gotta, I gotta eat this thing today. And all of that came up to like $10, I guess. I don't know. Like, no, yeah, about $10, $9, whatever. And then, oh, oh Jesus. Then I got Ambrose. Oh, heck. I don't remember the name of the store. Yeah, the name of the store ain't even on here. But, anyways, I got Ambrose some spicy Chicago. Oh, wait. Chicago spicy Italian is one uh, black guy makes his own uh, spices, and we always buy from him. Ambrose really likes it. I don't know if y'all can see that. There we go. Chicago spicy Italian. That'd probably be good as some spaghetti. Oh, it smells good. And then I got Cajun seasoning. Oh, yep. Yeah. I had call him and he always likes for me to get the uh the cajun seasoning so i also picked that up for him and the two of these was 14 dollars together so that is all that i spent today at the farmer's market there is a farmer's market like closer to me but i was hoping that this one was going to have like more stuff but i'm gonna have to visit the one that is closest to me this one is 30 minutes for me the run closest to me is probably like 15 minutes away. I don't know. I'm going to look them up to see if they are actually open tomorrow. Uh, and then go to that one tomorrow. But I do need to mail prep me some stuff. I want to make me some beans. I got a whole bunch of canned beans. So I'm going to try to get rid of those things first. Chop up some squash in there. I mean, not squash. I didn't buy squash. They're squash looking trifle. Zucchini squash. Chop me up some zucchini. I'm trying to wait for my body to cool off. Um, I might have to move y'all so I can get the AC going. Oh, my camera is hot. Sorry if I'm super close, y'all. But I got to turn this AC on. All right. But if y'all can hear it, so sorry. But um, I want to chop me up some zucchini and maybe some, make some rice and some beans. And... Uh, what else I got at home? What else I got? I'm making some lemonade. Y'all already know I'm gonna do something with those mushrooms. Right, there's some mushrooms in there too. If it's loud, y'all, I'm sorry, but I'm about to pass out. I'm so hot. I've been sitting here for a minute. So, I guess I gotta look and see what we got. And I need to clean that refrigerator out. I'm probably clean that refrigerator out today. I haven't been able to really clean anything because of this arm, this whole left side. I can't grasp things correctly. So, I haven't been able to actually grab stuff. 
but I have to clean that refrigerator out today. I don't know what that smell is in there. Something in the refrigerator smells awful. Hopefully y'all can still hear me and the fan isn't too loud. But I'm about to pass out, y'all. Go give me some water. I think I already said it. I'm going crazy, y'all. Anyways, I'll pick y'all later. Y'all, I'm eating. <laughs> they done started with these fireworks already. It's still July 1st. 7.50 p.m. I'm about to end the vlog here because I need to edit it. This is about to be a super long vlog and I hadn't been, I wasn't editing through, uh, throughout the week. I never made my bed. Oh, it's made, but I didn't put the pillows on there. But um, I've been running around all day. My arm hurt. My, just everything hurts because I'm old. <laughs> but anyways, you guys, I'm about to just relax. I was about to clean the kitchen. Like I cleaned the refrigerator out earlier with just my right hand and that was a struggle that took forever. But I'm gonna clean the kitchen tomorrow morning and cook tomorrow morning. Cook my uh, my meal prep for tomorrow as or next week as well. But I'm about to take just relax, relax my arm and take some naproxen or something so the inflammation on my arm can go down. But thank you all so very much for watching. If you haven't done so, give this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and I will talk to you all in my next one. Bye.